be bad what I saw. Like this is purposely spreading COVID-19. Many Canadians turning to police to report those not following social distancing rules put in place by all levels of government. But does it always warrant a call? A resident of Montreal's LaSalle Borough says he dialed 911 after witnessing a disturbing gathering. They was just touching the garbage bins and then they went you know, the door handles and they were spitting on it and they was touching all over. And then after that, I called the police and then I explained them the situation. On March 24th, Rehan alerted those in his neighborhood with many elderly people to beware of those doing this and to wipe down the surfaces outside their homes. His neighbor took to Facebook warning others and calling on them to report any incidents that can endanger lives. In a recent Leger poll, 64% of respondents says they personally witnessed people not respecting the COVID-19 measures like this scene in Edmonton where people were lining up closely at a bank. It's going to take distancing and time to flatten the curve but that's how we'll get through this. So let's save lives together by staying apart. Prime Minister Trudeau reminding Canadians on Thursday that their behavior alters what will happen in the future. The Quebec government is asking police forces to be tougher with fines. In Montreal, if you don't respect the rules, you could face fines ranging from $1,000 to $6,000. In Vancouver, it's up to $1,000. In Toronto, from $750 to $5,000. Montreal Public Health says police have already issued dozens of tickets for these reasons. On Wednesday, the city's official opposition leader, Lionel Perez, had the police call to his home after neighbors thought he was having a gathering. It was an engagement party by video conference for his daughter living in New York. In attendance, his wife and four kids, including one son with COVID-19, who live with him and a musician playing in his driveway. But when the cops showed up, they quickly asked the musician to leave. This philosophy professor at Laval University says reporting someone should be the last resort. It can be very frustrating if we see that some of our fellow citizens are not doing their share, are not uh, cooperating. In many situations, you know, we should just try to uh, talk to the people or uh, just hope that the authorities, you know, will uh, uh, catch up on them at some point. Government at all levels and authorities say not to hesitate and report citizens who aren't following social distancing and no gathering rules. In Montreal, Alicia Rubertucci, City News.